Hi, this is Lenora coming to you from Uganda. So glad to see you again. Wanted to tell you about a project that we're involved in here. As you know, our primary focus is to bring the Word of God. We teach a Bible school all over the country and we even bring people back here to our home base to teach them and equip them so they can make disciples. So what we're looking at here is the land, the first land that we've purchased for building the Bible school building. It extends down towards the well. It's one acre and then it comes back this way over to this way where you see that tall grass. And it's situated in a really great place because if you pan this way you see the church. After the church you see pastor's house and then the school. So this land actually comes right up next to the church's land. So it's really a great place for us to be. This area is actually starting to really get built up. There's a main road uh, just up about 10 minutes that takes a shortcut to Jinja. So it's starting to get a be very busy road. So we're very excited to build our very first teacher hall here and I think it's probably going to be here where you see the bricks. I think that's going to be the optimal place for it. We want to be able to accommodate about 100 students at a time and we also want to use this building to teach practical still skills such as sewing, cooking, uh, brick making, welding. So it's going to be a, a center that is used for many, many things. We would like to call it the Alpha and Omega Center. So we're covering everything from the beginning to the end. The Word of God, practical skills, uh, we'll even teach budgeting and accounting. And so we're also going to be putting a latrine, gotta have a bathroom, and we need to put a caretaker's home. Because this is Uganda, we need to have somebody living on site to, to just make sure that things are safe, things aren't stolen. So this is the project that we're working on and we're hoping to finish this by the end of 2022, this first building, the Lurchine and the caretaker's house, including uh, putting in solar so that they can have electricity. So just be praying and standing with us that God will make the provision so that we can start teaching more people Bible school. We can start equipping them so that they can go out and they can make disciples. We're very excited that God has provided this land and we're, we're um, really looking forward to what he's going to do by building that first teacher building and the latrine and the caretaker's home. So be standing with us, pray with us, be involved. Come and visit us. We love short time mission trips. We love long term missionaries. We would love to have you come and spend some time here in Uganda. Enjoy the matoki, which is uh, boiled banana. It doesn't sound good, but it's delicious. It's kind of like potatoes. We would love for you to come and help us build this building uh, in any support that you can give us regarding prayer and um, ideas and uh, blueprints. Anything you can think of, we, we totally welcome your involvement because we're not in this alone. We're all in this together. We're serving the Lord together. We're bringing the word to every corner of the earth. And we would love to see you involved in this project. So thank you so much for standing with us. May God bless your endeavors and continue to walk with us as we spread the word of God.